last night in the Band-Aid. Um, uh, that's fine. Uh, what I, where I am at this point is it's been three days going on four since this uh, horrific event occurred. A person lost their life, two have been severely injured. And yet we've not received a medical report from the hospital, nor have we received a medical report from the campaign or from the Trump organization about the extent of the damage to his ear. If he was shot by a high caliber bullet, uh, there should probably be very little ear there. Um, and so we'd like to know that. Is there cosmetic surgery involved? What is the, uh, the prognosis for recovery? Were there stitches? What, what is the extent and nature of the damage to his ear? Was it caused by a bullet as opposed to as some reports from those on the scene, other reporters, saying that it was actually uh, shards of glass from the teleprompter itself, not the bullet. So there are a lot of questions around that ear, um, and yet there's been no response to that, um, uh, instead just showing the, the image of the man coming into, into right. the hall let with me, the wounded ear. Let me jump so in that's on the that. politics. Let me jump in on that, and then we'll continue. We're looking at that photo. Uh, Michael Steele.